Hello, everybody! Welcome! Yes, as B-Man says, this is indeed Alec from two days ago. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? I hope you're all having a good and wonderful Monday afternoon. It is a Monday, right? Yeah, it's a Monday afternoon. This is every single time I find myself streaming outside of Thursday or Friday, I lose even more track of what day it is just because I'm so not used to streaming other than Thursdays and Fridays. But anyways... Hope you're all having a good, wonderful Monday afternoon. Thank you all so much for coming by, coming by and hanging out. So, today, we're going to be playing a hotly debated game in the community, which is, of course, New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe for the Nintendo Switch, which is a huge mouthful, by the way. But before we get started, I have to give a huge welcome to everyone that's tuning in live. So I see you all in the chat. B-Man, oh boy, David, Pika, Timmy, Aiden... Uh, DJ Riolu as well. Good to see you again, by the way. I feel like it's been a while. Um, welcome, everybody. I hope you're all having a wonderful, wonderful Monday afternoon. All right. Anyways, uh, thank God there wasn't a Luigi voice. I don't know. He said he was going to be here, but who knows? Maybe he'll be here later. Uh, <laughs> oh, and Timmy. Timmy, I forgot to say your name. Sorry. Uh, all right. So, uh, oh boy says, haven't had a nightmare last night that I haven't unlocked all the fighters in Smash, but as it turns out, it wasn't a nightmare, it was real life. You still haven't done that, oh boy? Come on now. Come on now. Sing you happy birthday. Um, maybe, maybe Luigi will stop by later and, uh, and sing you happy birthday. <laughs> I don't know, maybe, maybe by the time he gets here, he'll sing you happy birthday. We'll see though, Aiden, we'll see. But happy birthday to you, Aiden. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. Uh, the birthday song is copyrighted. That is really, really strange. Uh, <laughs> Angela Lewis, is that Odin? Did you rename your account to something else? Angela Lewis, if you're not Odin, welcome to the stream. If you are, welcome to the stream also. <laughs> My answer was the same regardless. All right. So, uh, let's go ahead and get started on some new Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe. God, that's so weird. I'm just gonna call this new Super Mario Brothers Switch. <laughs> All right, so God, I love the logo in this game. You know, this series gets a lot of flack for its really just average art style, and I think there is some merit to that. But I don't know. There's just something that fills me with so much joy. Um, nothing. There's nothing quite like downloading a brand new Super Mario Brothers game. Even if it's something that I've already played before, there's just something that makes me so happy about it. But anyway, so what do we got here on the main menu? So we've got New Super Luigi U on the top left. We have Challenges, which I've heard are pretty cool. Maybe we'll do some of those later. Uh, Boost Rush, which I don't know too much about, and Coin Battle. I believe this was actually all present in, uh, in the original release. Mika, welcome to the stream as well. Um, so I don't know about you guys, but whenever I come up to this conundrum of which save file to choose, I always choose the middle one. Uh, just because, um, I don't know, it, ju it just feels more satisfying to uh, pick the middle save file. Am I weird for that? Am I weird for that? Alright. So, let's go ahead and vote on which character we want to start the game as. I'm kind of leaning towards, uh, kind of leaning towards Toadette, but my only thing with that is that it supposedly makes the game easier. Um, I'm kind of leaning towards Toadette or just straight up Mario, but I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys uh, voice your opinion and we'll see what we want to do. Uh, Eevee does the same thing. Okay, good! I'm not alone! Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Toadette, best girl. Toadette is adorable. Phil! Welcome to the stream! Oh, what the heck? Oh, you can choose Blue Toad! I'm pressing the left trigger on the controller and it lets me choose Blue Toad. Well, there you go. Blue Toad's an option as well. <laughs> Look, it's New Super Mario and Luigi Brothers Party Cart U Deluxe and Knuckles with Funky Mode. <laughs> I had to add the with Funky Mode there. Uh, <laughs> Eevee does the best Toad impression, you know? I like to think that I do a pretty good Toad impression as well. <laughs> Alright, uh, it looks like... It looks like most of you are saying Toad. So we might just pick Toad. Blue Toad. We're gonna go Blue Toad, alright? Luigi or Toadette? Uh, we're gonna go Blue Toad. I think you can actually change your character um, over the course of the game, so I think I'm gonna switch to Toadette here in a little bit. Or at the very least, whenever we uh, jump into some Super Luigi U later. Um, 
I think I'll switch to Toadette for that one. I played Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze and beat it within the same day on Funky Mode. You know, surprisingly, as much of a meme that that mode is, I've never played it yet. Because <laughs> it's, it's supposed to make the game, like, almost unbearably easy, and I don't know. I like a little challenge in my games, so... Oh my god, he's gonna yeet them across- he yeet, he literally yeets them all the way across the land. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll get into some, you know, we'll get into some Toadette gameplay later. No worries, guys. That Toad render, though, some of these renders, I've... Like, after looking at them for so many years, I, I just really crave new ones. <laughs> PK memes! Alright. Infinitely rolling is fun, though. Funky- oh, that's in funky mode? I thought he was, like, infinitely snowboarding, or, like, sorry, surfboarding. I thought that was his thing. Uh, David says, Alec, the only new stuff is 1080p quality and Toadette with the power-up. Well, you know, truth be told, I don't remember a whole lot of this game. I don't know if it's the game's fault or if it's my memory serving me, serving me poorly, but, you know, it's gonna feel like a new experience to me, so... <laughs> As much as, uh, as much as this art style and gameplay can feel new to me. I put so many hours into the new Super Mario Bros. games for the 3DS, and gotta be honest with you, I don't know what the solution is for making these levels feel more memorable, but, um, needless to say, I don't remember a whole lot of this game, so whether that's good or bad, I'll let you decide. Anyways, um, alright, so we're in Acorn Plains... And I don't think we have anything else to do, so let's go ahead and get started. I don't remember the controls for this game, like, at all. <laughs> Mika says, I never had a Wii U, so this is all new to me. Well, neither did Proxens, so I'm sure that's all new to him as well. If you weren't here for the discussion, Mika, the other day, Proxens openly admitted that he's never owned a Wii U before, and it traumatized me! I had nightmares about it! And we should all just frequently remind him how uncultured he is for, for saying that. Not you, Mika, but for someone like Proxens? Come on now, what's wrong with you? Alright. Uh... I gotta say, like, using the control stick in this game just doesn't feel very natural. Uh... So I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the D-pad instead. Overkill, welcome to the stream! It says, hey man, just got Discord, how are you today? I'm doing well! I'm doing well. I hope you're having a good one as well. Were you the one that was, um... During last time stream, looking for the Discord link, I hope you end. I hope you ended up finding it. If not, we can post it in the chat again for you. But I remember somebody was asking me for the Discord link at the very end of the stream last time, and I don't know if they ever found it. <laughs> Mika says, "Oh, by the way, I'm actually awake for a stream. It's a miracle. <laughs> well, we're glad to have you." <laughs> Timmy says, "Same. Never had a Wii U. You know, that's forgivable. That's forgivable. But for someone like Proxens, who is." Let me remind you, a fellow brand ambassador for Nintendo, who's someone that I would have expected to own a Wii U to openly admit that he didn't? For shame. For shame. <laughs> what the heck is this? Also, something I find weird about this game is that I feel so oddly compelled to con collect every single coin that I see, despite the fact that I know that they really don't do anything. <laughs> That's just how ingrained this collecting mentality is, has been embedded into my mind by Nintendo. Oh my gosh. Maybe that would explain my amiibo problem. Yeet! Oh, I, I messed up. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, I can't tell if I like the control stick or the D-pad, actually. I don't like the D-pad that much on the Pro Controller, either. Huh. But look at my outfit! My blue toad acorn power-up outfit? This is adorable. <laughs> Restart the game and do it without collecting any coins? I, I feel like that would be kind of hard. Because they just throw so many coins at you, like, all the time. I feel like it would be really hard to avoid them. But there's a challenge right there. <laughs> Angela says, I'm not going to tell you why I'm not, I'm, I'm not using my real name. Not like I was using my real name to begin with, but oh yeah, I'm Odin Dark, so just call me Odin. I figured that's who you were. Your icon looked very familiar to me. Well, welcome to the stream, Odin. I hope you're having a good one. Ugh! What the? Oh, oh, what the heck? Could you have always have done that with this power-up? Get an extra jump like that? Wow, that is crazy. <laughs> P. 
Pika says, I can give him one of my Wii's. I have three because my grandma gave me one. My mom has one, and I gave one up No, I have one up north. Holy cow. How many Wii's do you have, Pika? Well, it seems like Proxens is in need of... Oh my goodness. I missed one? Oh, I missed two. Never mind. All right, I'm fine with missing. Ah, you know what? There goes the run. I'm missing all these coins. All right, whatever. I'm happy with that. Hecky! What the hecky? Blue Toad cosplay? Oh my goodness. I could do that. <laughs> Is it okay if Blue Toad has a beard? Do you guys think that's fine? That's not cursed or anything, right? Yeah, I think that's fine. Toad with a beard? That, that wouldn't look weird. Hey, that rhymed. What the? Where are you guys going? Oh my goodness, I'm running into stuff. Ah! That Goomba almost hit me. I'm running out of time? That can happen? I'm small again. This feels wrong. Alright then. Uh, Phil Swift says Proxens doesn't have any video games. I mean, have you ever seen Proxens in a video game in the same room? Hmm. That's, uh, that's the real question. <laughs> Thanks a million for your help. Here, take this. Oh, wow. What does this do? Proxens only plays weeb games. Fact. These are facts. He sent me, uh, a video trailer for this, like, mecha game coming to the Switch that I can't remember the name of. But it was very, very weeby. I don't think it's actually coming to the to the west or getting localized or anything, but it looks pretty cool. He said it's developed by level 5 and something like that. I, I told him that B-Man would definitely have a better idea of what that is than I would. <laughs> uh, Megaton Musachi, that's the one. I would have never remembered that name in a million years. I'm so hyped for that game. It looks pretty cool. It looks like a mega, it looks like a mecha anime, if I had to describe it. All right, fire blue, blue fire toad. Hello? Question mark. Oh, all right, it's dead. He died. Rip blue fire toad. Oh my goodness, you suck at this game. I haven't played this in so long. I haven't played a proper 2D Mario in so so long. So this is like. Oh. Oh. oh my goodness. Strangely enough, I'm way better at Celeste than I am at this game so far. What in the world is that? And Celeste is a game that's known for being difficult. Oh my gosh. You want to know something that I really like about this game, though? Even though it's a port and there's really not a whole lot that's new, I think the fact that you always have two-player co-op available via the Joy-Cons is really, really cool. This is a really, really fun game to just casually play with a couple friends and just have a good night together, you know? It's not really about, like, doing really well or getting the high score or whatever. It's just about, you know, just navigating through a Mario level. Classic 2D Mario. Also, thank you so much for the subscription. Oh my gosh! I'm gonna pull up your name here in a second because I actually couldn't read it fast enough. Oh my gosh. Alright. We did it! We did it! <laughs> wow, oh, Dant, welcome to the stream. Uh, where's that notification? I know it's in here somewhere. Gavin! Wait, is it Gavin? I don't know. But Gavin, thank you so much for subscribing. I didn't catch that name in time. What in the world? And it's not showing up on my dashboard for some reason. Whoever that was that subscribed, thank you so much. I'm sorry I didn't catch your name in time. Overkill says, just join the Discord. Thanks, have, well, thank you so much for joining. Welcome to our little community. I'll properly, I will properly welcome you once the stream is over, my friend. It's about rage when people keep losing. Well, here's the thing. Oh, no. Wait, was I... What in the world? Where does that go to? How do you get there? Can you fall? I don't want to fall. That'll probably kill me. I'm not falling for that one. <laughs> Daniel! Daniel Guzman! Guzman! Collect all the stars in the whole game and Nintendo will pay you one billion dollars. Well... <sighs> you guys... I feel like that would be a pretty hard feat to accomplish, to be honest. <laughs> I was gonna say that's the easiest billion dollars I've ever spent, or ever made, but... First of all, I've never made a billion dollars. And second of all, I feel like that'd be really hard. Because there's like, three different games in this game. 
<laughs> Does that make sense? <laughs> Whoop! Alright, where does this go to? B-Man says, I played this with a friend by World 3. He had 40 continues. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that seems wrong. I feel like you shouldn't be dying that much, but I don't know. I mean, I haven't died yet. And I'm trash at this game. Yeah, but for a billion dollars, I'd do it. I mean, I'd make an attempt. <laughs> billion dollars? Eh. Alright. Fine, I'll give, I'll give it a try. Where? Okay, I feel like I missed something. I missed that one star coin, and I don't know where it was. Oh well. Oh well. See what I mean? Like, this ain't a completionist run. We're just playing through some Mario, having a grand old time. Pika says, I have too much Nintendo things to say them all. Oh my gosh, that's a long list. Hold on one second here. Let me, let me grab this flag right quick. Yeet! Uh, I have three, I have too many things to name them all. Three 3DSs. Wait, three DS's, three 3DS's, two Game Boys, three Wii's, one Wii U, two Switches. Why do you have two Switches? One NES, one GameCube, and two Pokeball Pluses. Wow, <laughs> that's insane. I like the thing. The thing. The Nintendo thing that I own the most of is definitely the 3DS, just because of how many different special editions they came out with for that console. And I was weak. I was so weak because with all of them, I was like, I need it. The Pikachu one, need it. The, the, um, Link Between Worlds one, I need it. Uh, <laughs> the second Pikachu one, got it. Um, and then I think I have, like, two do I have two Zelda ones, and, um, two Pikachu ones, and then, like, uh, just, like, I have the original one, too, and then I have one for capturing, which is my pink original one, and then I have the one that I actually play on, which is a new 3DS XL. I have too many 3DSs. It's, it's, it's kind of a problem. <laughs> Aiden says, Alec, in the Nintendo canon, Blue Toad sacrificed his life so Joker could summon se What the heck is that?! For some reason, I feel like that's a lie, Aiden. I don't know, just some something about that seems incorrect. <laughs> oh, man. Who wants me to send Alec the Megaton Musachi trailer every day? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> you know, it's gonna get to a point, B-Man, where I'm just gonna... It's just gonna be like white noise. <laughs> Let's use an item this time. I don't know. Let's, let's, let's put on our star, man. World of Light is fun. World of Light is great, David. How far are you in that game so far? Dan says, can't wait for Big Jiggle Panda to play this game. I'm assuming that's a content creator, of which I've never heard of. But I like the name. <laughs> Very unique. What the hecky? What the? Oh my god, okay, so... Hold on, wait a minute! Wait just a darn minute. Is the... Is the twirl in midair button the same as the jump button? What the... Is it... Oh, wait a minute. It hasn't always been like that, has it? This feels weird. B-Man says, we'll get to the point where you'll cave and buy it to play with Leafy Frogs and Zizami. Are they both getting it too? Question mark? Nani? I'm always looking for stuff to play with those guys. David said, Pascaleem, I cannot say where after because it's spoilers. Well, we respect you for that. Thank you so much for not spoiling that for anyone else, David. You are the real MVP. Can I please get on this? There we go. Yeah, twirly is the same as jump. What the heck? It wasn't like that before, was it? Aiden says, yeah, they changed it to jump. Oh, oof. What the heck? Why? Oh, I lost that. All right. Oh my god, I... <laughs> Dry bones! Stop hitting me! Wow, I jumped right into him. I'm so... That really just happened. Laurel, welcome to the stream! You tuned in just in time for me to die to the same... Basically the same... Stinking dry bones. Like, three times in a row. <laughs> David says you probably could set your own controls. I don't think this game actually allows you to change the button mapping. Uh, Daniel says, do you play that game Fortnite? I don't. I, uh, I surely don't, unfortunately. I'm assuming that you're looking for me to play that game because I feel like everyone is. <laughs> All right, we're big again. All right, this time I'm not running into the same dry bones three times. Let's uh, just putting that out there. Also, I think this level is really violent because you can actually get squashed and die. 
instantly from all these giant gears. I do remember that from the Wii U version. All right, stop jumping in the dry. Listen, all right, I'm trying. I just realized that they changed the jump button's binding to that twirl button, so it's not all my fault. This twirl thing is really throwing me for a loop. But that's not necessarily an excuse either, but we're gonna pretend it is! I love that I can just throw him and kill him. That's so... so savage. Blue Toad is a natural killer. What? 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 How do people speedrun this game?! Oh my gosh, I can throw him at another Dry Bones and then it kills that Dry Bones. Oof! Okay, okay. Oh my gosh! Okay. Alright. Why is the jump button like that? Ah! Oh no. I did it! Yay! And I made up that life that I lost. I already have 14 lives. I feel like that's a I feel like that's a problem. <laughs> Checkpoint flag! I don't have to run into that Dry Bones ever again. He's gone for the rest of my life. Never have to see him. <laughs> so Marks is in Super Smash Brothers. How do you feel about that? I thought that was really crazy because, for one, I didn't rem I didn't actually have any memory of who Marks was until I played through World of Light. So to me, for like a good, you know, solid week, I was like, man, that random character in in uh, World of Light was actually kind of creepy. Come to realize he's actually from the Kirby series, so. But uh, it may- Oh my god! Ah! What the heck?! Oh, see what I mean? See what I mean? You could just die from getting squashed. David says, Fortnite is not as bad as people say, as long as you don't spend money. See, that's my thing, like, I don't really find myself being entertained really at all from the gameplay of Fortnite, but I don't hate it. It's just not for me. That's my opinion on that, and it always has been. Haha, -ha, yeet. Or pretty much any Battle Royale game, to be honest. I don't really get the appeal. Whoop, 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 whoop. Okay. Alright. We ain't getting squashed this time. Oh my! I'm playing so dangerously right now. Just for this one coin that's not gonna do anything for me. Oh my god, I just died again! <sighs> Nino Kuni is a hidden gem. I played a little bit of Nino Kuni originally on the PS3, and I thought it was pretty cool. It played a lot like a uh, Ghibli movie in some ways, which I thought was awesome. I never finished it though. We got squished. I keep getting squished by this stupid gear. <laughs> Stop getting coins, but I can't. It's like embedded into my mind to just collect everything I see on the screen. <laughs> Ugh. You say you won't be crushed. I will listen. All right. <laughs> It's not my fault, the game just automatically magnets me towards the edges. That's what it's doing. It's it's making me. It's not my fault at all! Ooh, that was, that was nice. It's one pesky coin! Okay, we're good. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be a repeat of last time. <laughs> and that's what I mean when it's about rage. <laughs> it's just like, these controls... This jump thing is just really confusing me. I feel like it shouldn't be this confusing. Confusing, but for some reason it is. And I can't tell you why. Goodbye, Dry Bones. Goodbye. We've got all the star coins, though, so that's all I could really... That's all that's really worth collecting, it seems. Nothing over here? Alright. If you die again... This level has killed me four times. <laughs> Alright. Uh, who are we facing? Is that Boom Boom that I saw on the top of the castle? Boom Boom? Eevee has a Switch, one 3DS, two DSs, one Game Boy, and a Pokeball... Oh my gosh, you guys are just serious collectors over there. Pika, that's awesome though. We got squished like a Goomba! Now it's time to squish him. We're gonna jump on his head like a Goomba. My favorite movies are Ghibli movies. They're really, really good. Gotta get that- well, oh god, that's cursed. That's cursed! I remember that song! That was- that feels like an eternity ago. 2009 Alec was probably listening to that song, but not really, because he didn't listen to the radio. It's the same artist from Ghibli! I didn't know that! 
That explains so much! <laughs> wow, that's actually really cool. Save? Yes, saved all the progress that I've just made, so I don't have to go through that castle again. Uh, Acorn Plains, three. Level three. Uh, Dan says, play some Super Smash Brothers so I can wreck you with my Toon Link. Oh, man. Well, let me tell you what, Dance. Uh, we will be playing Smash on Thursday. And we'll be doing viewer battles on that day. And if you want to come out for Thursday, I'll show you a thing or two about my Lucina play. Improved over the past couple, we couple of weeks. Ooh. You mean the Black Room Listen. All right. All right. Yes, that's the one that I meant. People called me Mop Top back then, too. Yoshi! Yoshi! Oh, yes, perfect. What does Yoshi do in this game? He just gives me extra jump height? I think that's what it is. Apples! Apples, apples. Alec, watch My Neighbor Totoro. I've seen that movie so many times, Aiden, you probably wouldn't believe me. You probably wouldn't even believe me if I told you how many times. AKA okay, getting one kill with Incineroar's up B. <laughs> Do you like my new icon? I love it. It matches the one on Discord. Oh my gosh! Yoshi, I just threw you to the wolves. I'm sorry. I need these coins. I know B-Man's probably cringing right now, but I need them. Oh my gosh! Oh, you can jump on them. Did not know that. See? See, this game's like a basically a new game for me. <laughs> Alright. I do remember some of the mechanics, though, so I'm not totally in the dark. Oh, you can eat them! Oh, yikes. Well, cool. That was a level. That was, that, that was a little hidden area. I will kill you all. I have Toon Link in Elite Smash, my dude. Let me tell you something, Dan. I currently have, as of last night, eight characters in Elite Smash. Um, I've got... Whoop! Ah! Oh my goodness! Yoshi, come back here, please! Don't run from your master! Um, I have Lucina in Elite Smash. I have Krom in Elite Smash. I have Ganondorf in Elite Smash. I have Bowser in Elite Smash. I have, uh... I can't remember the other ones. Uh, Young Link is in there as well. And I believe Adult Link is too? Um, I don't know. But I do have eight currently, and I'm on the quest for getting all 74 in Elite Smash. <gasps> oh my goodness! I can't believe I just ate him before he could even come out of his come out of his home. <laughs> Yoshi, please! Oh, he just died. All right. Well, it was a good run, but now I have another one. <laughs> oh, that's so weird. There's like an infinite supply of Yoshi's in this universe. Oh my gosh! Can I live in peace, please? You stupid gophers! Just let me have my pet. One v one me, Toon Link or versus Toon Link or Young Link. I am so down for that, Dan. You should stop by on Thursday. We're gonna have viewer battles. Or, um, if you're part of the Discord, I actually play with, um, I play, actually, we actually play on Discord, like, pretty frequently, even if I'm not streaming. So, if you're ever looking for people to play Smash Brothers with, that's a good place to start. Well, lost my Yoshi, and I landed at the very bottom of the flag. But you know what? We made it through the level, and that's all that matters. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> B-Man, I have this problem with these levels where I really just want to collect everything in one go. And I cannot shake that behavior for whatever reason, despite the fact that I know the coins pretty much do nothing. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like this. Hey, I'm Baby Yoshi. You look like you know where to find food, so I guess I'll follow you. Alright. I've always thought that the Baby Yoshis in this game look very odd. <laughs> Oh, Roy and Marth. Yeah, those are the other two. Thank you, Laurel. Yeah, those are the other two characters that I have in Elite Smash. Oh! The Ow! The baby Yoshi just died! He just literally walked off the cliff! I couldn't even get to him fast enough! What? Oh, no. All he wanted was some food. Ah, crap. 
Well, where am I supposed to find another baby Yoshi? I feel like those are a lot harder to come by than regular Yoshis. Oh, man. <laughs> Master L's Gaming, welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good Monday afternoon. Thanks for stopping by. We're just hanging out and playing some new Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe. Yes, that is the name. What the heck? The clouds are coins? Insanity. Okay, so what am I supposed to do about uh, getting over to that platform all the way up there on the top? I feel like Baby Yoshi was supposed to help me get there. <laughs> Ow! Well, I just died too. Jumping is so weird in this game. Dan says, do you play Splatoon 2? Yes. We also stream Splatoon 2. We played through the um, through the event uh, relatively recently, Frosty Fest. Uh, what was that, like uh, two weeks ago or something? Also, it's Mars, get it right? Okay, my bad. Mars. <laughs> uh, well, sorry to say, but we're gonna have to complete this level without our baby Yoshi. So, uh, rip in the chat for baby Yoshi. <laughs> Woo! F! F! Why am I so not good at this game? <laughs> Aren't these supposed to be easy, or am I just misremembering? Whoa! That almost killed me. That stopped all my upward momentum from my jump. <laughs> oh, what the heck? What the heck? Alright, I see what you mean, Dant. Oh my gosh. How am I supposed to get that one? What in the world? Woo! I love how the Koopas dance to the music. That is the cutest thing ever. B-Man says, sorry, I had to take a second to go get <laughs> to get over the coins. <laughs> Don't judge me! Ah! What is this doing? I don't know! Oh wow, a one-up mushroom. Wow, fantastic! Input obligatory Bowsette comment, welcome to the stream, Ace! I hope you're having a good Monday afternoon, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, this game doesn't have Bowsette! What's up with that? Oh my god, I just died. Oh my god, I just died. This game is killing me! <laughs> Yeah, this game doesn't have Bowsettes, and, um, you know, to be honest with you, I'm thinking about returning it because of that. <laughs> Where's your wife? Is she getting you a body pillow at Walmart? I hope so. I hope so. I'm long overdue for that body pillow at this point. She's slacking. Bowsettes curse. Bowsettes not real. She has to be. She has to be. Ah All right, that's it. I'm just going to go through the level like normal. I'm not gonna collect anything! It's not even worth it! I just keep dying! Oh wow, you can actually just speed through that entire thing. That was very short. <laughs> Are all the levels like that? <laughs> Laurel says, I do too as well, I have over 1,000 hours in Splatoon. Yes, Laurel is a monster at that game. And by that I mean she's really good. Dan says, that's what I mean by rage and stuff. <laughs> Listen, alright? Bowsette is blessed. Uh, let me see here. Toad is the Satan's little devil. Like, there are so many theories about Toad and where he belongs in the Mario universe. I'll believe anything at this point. Um, B-Man says, I'm waiting for the eShop to put it in a certain pre-order so I know if I'll have enough for Inside Story. Do they do pre-orders on the 3DS? Is that a thing? I haven't bought anything digitally on the 3DS in so long. Alright, uh, uh... We're in a castle level. Cool. These are historically known to be really easy, right? What's up here? Can I just speed run this? All right. Look at that. This is only this is the true intellectual way of completing this level. It's just going up on that on that uh upper part. Oh no! You know, um I wasn't anticipating dying this much, but here we are. <laughs> Yeah, it says that Toadette's the only one, unfortunately, that can wear the the super crown. I think it would have been really hilarious to, to see everyone else have the ability to do that, but I'm sure that would have been a designing nightmare. I wouldn't want Peach if I had Bowsette. That's very true. That's very true. All right, true intellectuals way. Getting all these coins up here. Have you guys seen speedruns of this game? It's actually nuts. 
They have it down to a rhythm, to where you basically just don't lose momentum the entirety of the level. Pretty crazy. I think they did it for last uh, Awesome Games Done Quick. Woo! Or something like that. I, re I remember watching a speedrun somewhere. At the very least, they did it for the Nintendo World Championships a couple years back, which was cool, by the way. That event, that entire event was really awesome. Whoa! Wow, this acorn suit really makes it super easy. Oh, I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna die if I do. I love the little flapping animation. That's adorable. As I gracefully glide onto Drybones' head to knock him out. Oh my gosh, alright. Oh, that was some concentration there. <laughs> Can't wait to see how much you'll die at Iggy. Probably. Probably. Considering how much I don't like the Koopa Kids, and how much this game is out to get me, I will probably die a lot to them. <laughs> Just calling it now. Alright, who is this? Who this? Open the door. Nintendo was like, oh god, why internet and made it only Toadettes? <laughs> oh. Kingdom Hearts 3 in two weeks? That doesn't even sound real. I feel like that game's been in development for so long. And you want to know something that I just remembered today is that the Kingdom Hearts, or no, the Final Fantasy 7 remake still hasn't come out either. And we haven't seen much of it since its reveal. The crown can work not only for Toadette, but for other female Toads as well. Are there, like, do other female Toads look anything like Toadette? Or do they just look like regular Toads? There's a lot of different things about the Mario universe that confuse me. Most recently, uh, the trailer for Yoshi's Crafted World, and how baby Bowser looks exactly like Bowser Jr. for some reason <laughs> in the trailer. I don't know what's up with that, but um, that is something that has been haunting my dreams lately. Yeah! No, what the? You could knock me out of the sky with that? All right. Whoa! He almost got me there. He had the fake. He had the fake out for a second. <laughs> Laurel says, "Yeah, but we all know Toadette's the only female." Also, it says Toadette, not female Toads. I mean, true. Very, very true. Although, the weird thing is that in the Paper Mario series, there are things like female Toads, male Toads, old Toads, young Toads, baby Toads. Like, there are so many different variations on the Toad species in Paper Mario. And you don't really see that all too often in the main Mario series games. <laughs> so, I don't know. I have so many questions about Mario. Like, I, I have so many Mario questions as far as lore and, like, stuff like that goes. But we'll probably never get the answers to them. <laughs> Layer Cake Desert! This place looks delicious. I could really go for some cake right now. Is it weird to buy yourself a cake despite the fact that there's no special occasion for it? Because I've done that a couple times and it's great. I might go do that after the stream's over. <laughs> like, run to the store and buy myself a chocolate cake or something. <laughs> ay yay yay. Alright, Stone Eye Zone? Well, what's this over here? This looks like something. Ah? Uh, ah? Uh, I knew it! Wait, crap, 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 crap! I don't know if that would have instantly killed me or not, but... Are you kidding me?! This random chipmunk thing, out of nowhere, just hits me. Oh. Ugh. What the hecky? Oh my goodness! Look at all those coins I missed. But you know what? That's fine. As B-Man says, I don't have to collect them. Ugh. Oh, I love that the, the paratroopas even dance while they're in the air. No! Stop! Ugh. My god. Where do these chipmunks come from? I know they're not chipmunks, they're flying squirrels, but still! I feel like chipmunk is more demeaning to them. They're being mean, so they deserve it. Oh my god, stop! Where do they keep coming from? <laughs> this game is out to get me! That's right. I saw you that time. Oh, well there goes a the one-up mushroom. Um... Aha! These coins are worth it. Do you not have sideways jumps in this game? I know you have triple jumps, but do you have sideways jumps at all? Or like wall jumps? 
Oh, no, oh, never mind. You have wall jumps. That's confirmed. Side jumps are what I miss, because that's, like, the most used maneuver, maneuver that I have in, like, pretty much every Mario game. Ah, come on! Okay, fine. Mika says, five... Final Fantasy VII Remake is still happening, they're just focusing on Kingdom Hearts right now. Man, that feels like... Feels like it's been forever since the last time we saw anything about the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Is there a burger in this game? <laughs> welcome to the stream, Jabron! Hope you're having a good one, thanks for stopping by. Welcome, welcome. There are no burgers as far as I've seen, but... I will say that there is cake. And that's where we are now, in Layer Cake Desert. It's kind of funny that they use the term desert, because it's spelled very similarly to, similarly to the word dessert. I wonder if that was on purpose. Uh, Dan says, you know how you say you have so much theories about the Mario universe? Well, just watch some game theory, my dude. Well, here's the thing. Uh, I don't think there's any episodes currently about the Baby Bowser thing from the Yoshi's Crafted World trailer, because it's so recent. But I would love to have an answer to that, because <laughs> it's been bothering me. <laughs> For those that don't know, uh, there was a Yoshi's Crafted World trailer that was announced on Twitter uh, recently. Give me one second. Oh, this is terrible. Some weirdo stole a bunch of my stuff. And he's so fast. I'll never catch him. You gotta help me. He's asking another toad for help. And he's all the way at level one? All right, level one. Um, so yeah, in the Yoshi's Crafted World trailer, um, it's like, it's like a, it's a trailer that kind of shows you what the story is going to be like in the game, and in the trailer, um, in the trailer, there was mention of Baby Bowser, and in the trailer you can see the game refer to this character on screen as Baby Bowser, but the problem with that is the Baby Bowser in the trailer, supposedly, looks exactly like Bowser Jr. And if you've been keeping up with the Bowser variations over the years, Bowser Jr. and Baby Bowser are technically different characters. So that has been really, really confusing me for the past, like, a week or two since that trailer dropped. I'll be back in 12 minutes. Sounds good, Pika? Oh, yes. Give me a real challenge, Nabbit. What the? Wow. Okay, he's, he got lucky on that one. Woo! This is a speed run! <laughs> is that all I have to do? Oh, wow. All right. Book them, boys. Take them downtown. Put them in the station. What the heck is that? A, a pea acorn mushroom? I'm definitely watching this. Please do. Because I don't want to be alone in my confusion. <laughs> They have always looked the same. They have not always looked the same, B-Man. They have not always looked the same. Um, like the most recent appearance of Bow Baby Bowser, to my memory, was in like the Mario Party series. And Baby Bowser looks nothing like Bowser Jr. And come to think of it, I think, um... In Super Mario Sunshine was when we first saw Bowser Jr. And that design that you see in Super Mario Sunshine looks almost identical to um, the Yoshi's Crafted World trailer. So, they are not the same, B-Man. Thank you very much. Have you seen Partners in Time? I have not. You don't know, do you know <laughs> what that is? The first time I played... You played this game on the Wii U. Nice. I did too, but... To be honest with you, I don't really remember a whole lot of it. Uh, no, technically they are different characters, so why they use the Bowser Jr. model, I don't know, but it confuses everybody- Exactly! I don't know what's up with that. It's really throwing me for a loop, Nintendo, I need answers! That was not the- Right?! <laughs> I feel like more people need to be made aware of this, so I'm glad that you saw that and you're now confused as well, Dance. Those are Koopa Kids from Mario Party, not Baby Bowser. Well, I thought the Koopa Kids were like Roy, Lenny, and Wendy and all them. If they're not the Koopa Kids, then who is the Koopa Kids? And wh where do they fit? Are the, are the Koopa Kids like Bowser's kids? 
Or are they just random Koopas that just happen to be kids? You know what I mean? Like, I'm so lost <laughs> as to what the Bowsers are. <gasps> oh, yay, yay. Oh my gosh, he just eats people. Oh, that is adorable. He's singing! He's singing! Did you see that? Oh, that is adorable. The real question is, what are Brutals? That's a, that's another very good question. Weren't the Brutals, like, wasn't the first time we ever saw them in Mario Odyssey? Because I don't remember seeing them as a character before then. This little cute singing baby Yoshi is adorable. Alright, I'm gonna hang on to him for the rest of the level just because it's so hard to see otherwise. Whoa! He just eats them! What a monster! But he's so adorable when he does it! Alright, moving forward. Eyes back, just got some hot chocolate with my one-piece cup. Nice. Welcome back, Aiden. You guys are making me hungry and you're not even trying. I wonder if I should just stop by the grocery store after the stream and just buy myself a giant cake for no reason. He can eat fire! That's insane. Okay, uh, how to get underneath this ramp? Ah, here we go. I didn't want to drop him because I thought he was going to run away, but I think we're good. I think we're good. You're bad. No, you, Macaulay. Also, welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good one. Thanks for stopping by, man. <laughs> Yeet! Oh, I missed one. I missed a star coin somewhere. I just got out of class. Congratulations. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Now that you have freedom. Oh my gosh. We need to play more Smash sometime. By the way, Macaulay. We had a. We had a an arena opened the other night on Discord, and I was looking for you, but I think you were probably sleeping, because it was kind of late. We were playing with Seabass and all them, so it was fun. Been on campus for 12 hours because of... <laughs> because of the hours for my classes. That's disgusting! What the heck? I don't think there's anything that I could do for 12 hours and feel good about it, you know? I feel like that's a long time to do anything. Eat him! Eat him! No! Alright, I don't, I don't want to lose my baby Yoshi, that's all I care about. I lost my power up for the Fire Flower, but that's alright. <laughs> Jeez. Abel says, Nabbit is so bad because you can probably beat the game in a day. Yeah, Nabbit and Toadette are not typically my style, but I'll probably try Toadette here in a little bit just so I can see the new Super Crown ability and what that's all about. Oh my goodness, stop hitting me with the fire. All right, I think that's pretty much the end of the level here. Woohoo! It's so cute! Oh, they're singing! Woohoo! Um, Dan says, Okay, going to give you some knowledge, but you know how animals can repopulate without female like lizards, and Bowser is a lizard, so figure- Well, here's the thing! I don't know where I was going to go with that, actually, but I'm still confused, okay? And- we know for a fact that Bowser Jr. has a mom because the whole point of Super Mario Sunshine was the quest for looking for his mom, which he thought was Peach. And Bowser never told them otherwise, so... You know what? I'm actually not sure what kind of conclusion I'm supposed to draw from that. <laughs> that bald gamer, welcome to the stream, sir. It's been a while. How's your Monday evening going? I'm assuming it's evening for most of you. It's evening for me. Uh, Gibran says you should have an official subreddit so we can post a lot of burger and body pillow meal. Here's the thing. We have a Discord, and you can post all of that stuff there in the meme channel. We have a channel made specifically for memes. <laughs> so if you want to put that there. Bowser lied to him, I know! What the heck is up with that? That whole game was about how Bowser Jr. was just misled by his dad. As far as I can tell, anyway. <laughs> how are you liking the game, man? It's So far, it's pretty enjoyable, to be honest. 
I'm probably gonna put a video together explaining my thoughts in full so I can write them down and get everything I want to say out, but... To be honest, like, this game series, as much flack as it gets, it's literally just, it's good, clean, 2D Mario fun. You know? I don't think it's meant to be, um, reinventing the wheel, you know? I don't think that's what this game series is all about. But I'm liking it. Oh my gosh, those pro-level strats! Did you just see that? I am a god. <laughs> Bowser made Wendy when he ate at Wen- I'm so lost. I don't even know what's going on anymore. <laughs> also, Bowser, at the end of it, tells him that Peach is not his real mama, and Bowser Jr. says, I know, Papa. Well, what the heck? What was the point of kidnapping Peach? <sighs> Ugh. You see, these are the questions that haunt me late at night, because I know that we'll never get a, an official statement or answer from Nintendo about this stuff. <sighs> and I'm probably looking way too far into it, but... I need- I have questions that I want answered, and that's all I'm saying. <laughs> that's well said, thank you. I think people look a little bit too far into it whenever they say that this game is like, oh, you know, there's not that much new about it, and the art style's done to death, and blah blah blah, and it's like, you know... I mean, there's a place for it. In the- in the- in the Nintendo lineup. There's a place for every kind of demographic, and I- for us, the, for the people that are really big Nintendo fans like myself and like other vocal members of the community, I don't think that these games are actually made for us. They're made for someone that's more of a casual player. But as someone who, is des who desires probably a little bit more from a Mario game than this, I, still can, I can still recognize that this is a, a darn good Mario game. Or a 2D Mario game, I should say. If you're a god, the world is doomed. <laughs> you know what? That's a fact. That's a fact. I'll let someone else do that job. I, that's, I, I don't want that. It sounds like too much responsibility. Oh my goodness! I wish Toad could flip like that all the time. I don't have a reason for saying that. I just I think it would be funny. I'm looking for this last star coin. It's hiding from me somewhere. <laughs> the point is, Bowser wants to marry Peach. That is what. Well, that was only a thing in uh, Super Mario Odyssey. I think otherwise, uh, oh god, whoops. I think I was supposed to do this. There we go. One more time, one more time. Perfect. Uh, uh, let me through, please! Oh, it's gonna hit me. Ow. <laughs> I just had to accept my fate with that one. Uh, so Bowser Jr. has come from an egg. Well, is there more than one Bowser Jr. then? If it's as, if it's just as simple as hatching from an egg? And who are the Koopa Kids? And where do they fit into the Bowser family tree? Ha! Oh, dang it. Bowser always wanted to marry Peach. Where have you been? Well, I thought it was just him, like, wanting... <laughs> this is a really, like... <laughs> this is a really, um... What's the word I'm looking for? Uh, alternative thought for me to have as a child, but I've always thought that he wanted to kidnap Peach for the sake of governing the Mushroom Kingdom and having control over it. Not necessarily for marrying her. I thought his dreams were more political than anything else. <laughs> Is that not the case? Have I been, like, thinking wrong the whole time? I read your comment, Dante. It's, uh, Bowser Jr.'s come from an egg, but how do we know that? How do we know that for sure? Have we ever seen a Bowser egg? That sounds weird to say out loud, to be honest. I don't know how I feel about Bowser eggs. <laughs> Italians on the Gamer, welcome to the stream! Hope you're having a good Monday evening. Welcome to our chat about Bowser lore. <gasps> uh, what about Boom Boom? Um, you know, I don't know where the Koopa the Koopa kids, quote-unquote, fit. I don't know if they're like Bowser's kids or like Bowser Jr.'s cousins or what, but I don't know. Just the whole Bowser thing really confuses me. Especially after that uh, Yoshi's Crafted World trailer recently. Is there supposed to be music playing in this level? Or do I just not hear it? 
Okay. I intend to stay... Can I not get hit immediately after I get a mushroom? <laughs> Can that just not happen? That'd be wonderful. All right. I'm probably going to die here. Um, I'm going to stay never... Oh, have a good one, Pika. I didn't realize that you were leaving. Oof. Oof! There we go. Oh, yes. Perfect. Perfect! Just what I needed. Yes, wonderful. Now I just gotta not get hit by these things. Which is a lot easier said than done. This, this timing is so weird. Okay, we're good. That's that. This little twirl maneuver actually really helps you in a pinch. I'm still here. Check the Discord in the pets or memes. I will check after the, after the stream, Pika. But I really hope that you're posting some cute animals in there because that's... That's what we made it for. The beauty of the fur babies. Oh my god! Ah! Okay. Oh, I think we're safe. I think we're safe. Woo! Uh... Alright, well, here we go. Uh, boss fight as Baby Toad. <laughs> uh. Going to use oh, I already read the lizard thing, Dante. That scream sounds like Toad scream. Don't say it like that. Now I'm not going to be able to hear it any other way. <laughs> oh no. Am I actually a Toad? Oh! My goodness. Alright. That's a one. No! Oh, I didn't jump in time. That was my bad. <laughs> ugh. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Do I have any power-ups that I can use? I think I have an acorn. Give me my acorn. There it is. All right, let's use that. Perfect. I think that's actually going to help us a little bit, <laughs> just because I've been dying so much. <laughs> I've been dying way too much. Oh, I have to get that other one again. Oh, no, the third star coin. Poopy. I'll sub if you beat this level. Well, here we go, guys. That's the real challenge here. <laughs> what the? Oh, there's hidden blocks there. They're everywhere. They won't stop. Okay. All right. <sighs> Once I beat this level and I beat Boom Boom, will there really be anything else I need to accomplish in life? Okay, now I hear the music. Thank goodness. I thought it was broken. Yeah, there's some specific timing that needs to be done here. But it's pretty easy once you get the hang of it. There we go. Easy peasy. Now all of you just clear out. And I lost my acorn. But that's okay. I made it all that way with just a regular baby toad, so... We should be able to make it even further with Big Toad. You like my PFP matches my Discord? Yes, I do. It makes it easier for me to distinguish who's who, especially when people have different names on YouTube and Discord. <laughs> that can get really confusing. Oh my god, I just lost it again. Well, heck. Maybe if I go this way or something. I don't know. I feel like this game needs to feed me more power-ups! Because I'm just so bad! Free. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Now that I'm kind of more conditioned to the R button being used for my... My mid-air thingy. Like the twirl. Uh, it's actually a lot easier. Perfect. It'd be great if I had a mushroom, though. <laughs> That would just be so, so- Yeah! Woo! Thank you, blessed Miyamoto, or whoever it is responsible. Dave, welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a good Monday afternoon. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us. Oh, the music it was playing, you're just hard of hearing. I have it turned low, because I don't have headphones for both my um, Switch speakers and my uh, computer. Well, I have the volume turned on really low on the speaker, so sometimes if the music's just really quiet, I just can't hear it. Oh my gosh! Ah! Oh, come on, we got this. Easy! 
Let's go! Baby Toad wins! <laughs> Ask and you shall receive, I know! That was like an answer from the gods. Dan says, OMG, not that one. This is the last time I see, but there's a game theory video about how Bowser Jr. was born. I should do that. I should definitely give that a watch. I like game theory because it delves into a lot of these questions that I have sometimes. Thank you for sharing. I will definitely look into that. I hope everyone's proud of me because I'm playing Kingdom Hearts 2 on proud mode. Is that really the name of the mode? Proud mode? <laughs> Sub, thank you, Daniel. <laughs> I appreciate it. Hopefully you're enjoying your time here, by the way. I think you've been here since the beginning of the, of the stream. Dave says, dude, you should make an Instagram. I do have one. I haven't posted on it in like four or five years, though. I only use it to like look at other people's posts. I don't actually post anything to it. I mostly use Twitter for that kind of stuff. Perfect. Get outplayed. Sub, thank you so much. I appreciate you, Italian Zonda Gamer. Is that how you pronounce that, by the way? Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, there's a toad house there. Could use some more items. Are you smart, says Dant. Um, well, um, I'm going to let you draw your own conclusions on that one. Can we switch to Toadette now? Does it let you switch characters? If memory serves me correctly, I think it does. Oh man, that's a lot to keep track of. How do I pick one? Oh. There we go. No! Oh, I didn't mean to throw that one. Well, hopefully it's something good. <laughs> yes, it's the second hardest mode. That's an interesting name for a, for like a difficulty. Game theories don't make sense a lot of the sometimes. I mean, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. A lot of the ones that I've seen are actually really cool. But then again, I really only watch, like, the Nintendo-related ones, because, um, Nintendo lore is something that you could just talk about for hours, I feel like. <gasps> Bonus level! You should make an Alec and Stuff subreddit. Maybe someday. For now, I think the Discord is serviceable. Maybe someday, though, Jabron. Food theory, thanks for munching. <laughs> food theory, what would that even be? Like theories about how different foods came to be or something like that? It sounds delicious though, I would watch it. I feel like that's a niche, you know, with like gaming and food. Nerdy Nummies does it pretty well, but I feel like there needs to be more food related video game crossover, you get what I mean. Give me the coins! Give me the coins! Oh, Star coin! Yay, the fishy boopkins level! Fishy boopkins! Ooh. There we go. Perfect. First star coin. It, it really bothers me for some reason whenever I miss a star coin in a level. So much so that I believe it was in, like, New Super Mario Bros. 2 for the DS? Um, that I would not progress any further in that game unless I got all the star coins in the level that I was in. Oof! Fishy Boopkins Meatball, welcome to the stream! I hope you're having a good Monday afternoon. Thanks for hanging out with us and stopping by. I appreciate ya. I almost died. I saw my little toad life flash before my eyes. <laughs> that was scary. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay. Me and Timmy are banned from Twitter, but they think we were 10, but in real life we were 13. That's so weird. Can you dispute that at all? I wonder. I don't know how claims like that work on Twitter. Whoa! See what I mean? That little twirl saves you sometimes. Fishy Boopkins! That's a catchy name. Oh god. Did I... Did I hit this way too high? Okay, never mind, we're good. I was like, I can't reach it! <laughs> ah! Okay, I kind of deserved that one. I wasn't running when I should've. Are you a full-time content creator? Not currently. 
I'd love to be someday, though. I do my best to stream as much as I can. And make videos and stuff. What the heck? Was this power up in the original? I don't remember this tiny thing. Dun, 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 dun. Aha! Nothing can hurt me! I feel like I'm oddly more vulnerable, though. <laughs> as a tiny toad. <gasps> I go so far! Oh my god, I missed one. I missed a star coin somewhere. Ugh. Yeah, I watched Dirty Nummies and that's where I saw Matt Tat said in the gummy food versus real food part one. Ah! Yeah, Nerdy Nubbies just makes me hungry watching, so I don't watch it too much. <laughs> but, I feel like I should. She makes really good stuff. Uh, Blooming Lack- Okay, so was- <laughs> Where did you guys get the- The boop- Oh, I missed a star coin, I know, right. Where'd you get the Boopkins name from? Because that wasn't the name of the level. Oh yes, please. Give me a normal mushroom. That was so weird. Being that tiny. It was like it was like me playing this game in real life. Haha! <laughs> Perfect! Listen. It's free real estate. I love having these clouds because it's like you just course through the level. For the most part. Obviously, it dies after a while, but... Wasn't there a game that you could actually ride that infinitely if you were able to capture it? Ah! How do you not know? Uh, because I'm not a huge fan of the New Super Mario Bros. games. I don't play them all too often. Sounds like a reference to something, though. <laughs> Super Mario Galaxy... Four? What? <laughs> it's free real estate. <laughs> Whoa! Ah, he's raining death from above! Ooh, hey, what's up? Three coins. Even though I know they don't do anything. Whoa, please! Bye! Yeet. Oh my god! It's gonna leave! <laughs> oh yes, perfect. That's exactly what I want, Ted. Cool. SMG4 is a channel. I've never watched them. I've never watched them. So there's your answer, Dance. That's why I don't know. <laughs> Italian says you should try going into full screen on a video and press awesome and something will happen. Press awesome. Press awesome! All right, Morton. Oh, one of my least favorite Koopa kids. They're all my least favorite, to be honest. There is a YouTuber called SMG4, and Spike name in it is called Fishy Boopkins. I should definitely check that out then. I feel like I'm missing out on, like, a pretty good reference. <laughs> Pika says, my dad spooked me, and I turned off my phone. Well, welcome back. Welcome back. My dad has a history of scaring me on Halloween. There was this one time where uh, I was really little. This was like years ago, and um, he was uh, dressed up as like a like a vampire or something. And keep in mind, I was really little, by the way. I don't think I was even in elementary school yet. And uh, he came up behind me and scared me so bad that I that I ended up throwing up. And then he felt he feels bad about it to this day. <laughs> I had to I had to um, resign from trick or treating for the night because I just did not feel well for the rest of. <laughs> for the rest of the evening, so uh, my friends had to resort to going to the houses for me and getting candy for not only themselves, but for me as well. And that was, uh, that was a day I'll probably never forget. <laughs> I gotta go, I'll be back. Oh, hold on. Oh, I keep missing that pipe. I gotta go for now. Might be back, though. Sounds good, Meatball. Sounds good. If I don't see ya, have a good rest of your night. I found a shirt at the mall saying it's free real estate. Timmy said it's dumb, but I said it's free real estate. <laughs> That's just one of those memes that I feel like will never die. He came into my room and gave me a muffin, and I wasn't ready. Well, like, I wish my dad gave me a muffin. 
All he did was give me anxiety for the rest of the Halloweens that were thereafter. <laughs> oh, man. His videos are long, and OMG... His videos are funny. Watch if Mario was a Baldi mute. Oh my gosh. Baldi is like... I, I don't know. That character makes no sense to me. <laughs> He's like really, really creepy in a way. And um, I've only seen like one of those videos. But I, I, I just came out of it confused. <laughs> I was like, what kind of accent is Baldi trying to trying to speak here. I could not place it for the life of me. Woo! Oh my goodness. Oh, we got this. Star core! <laughs> okay. We got this. Easy money. Are you kidding me? That totally hit him. Whatevers. Whatevers. We got it back. It was really good, but small. I mean, as long as it was tasty. Man, you guys are making me so hungry. What the heck? <sighs> ah. All right, we're just gonna run through this part. I have all the star coins, so that's all I could ever ask for. Ah! I was so sad that that would have squished me. Get up there. <laughs> what the heck? <gasps> oh my gosh! Woo! I felt like I was gonna get squished there for a second. Alright. Back to Fire Flower. I will give you $50 if you watch the video now. I will watch it later. Thank you for the offer, though. I feel like you actually wouldn't have done that to begin with. <laughs> Pika says... Oh, hi. Welcome to Baldi's Basic Education. Fortnite, that's me. Oh my gosh, what? Yeah, Baldi, uh, Baldi doesn't make sense to me. It's very scary. Press A and then W, then E, and etc. You're gonna have to explain that to me again, Italian on the gamer, because... Are you talking about, like, a regular YouTube video you can do that on? Alright, Morton. Face me, you coward! None of the other ones were this large. Go see what I sent you on Discord. I will in a little bit here, Gibran, when the stream is over. Oh my gosh. He's switching up his moves. His strategies have changed. Whoop! That's right. That's right. Get destroyed. <laughs> I do a great impression, and someone on Fortnite got mad at me because I was so good he believed it. <laughs> Oh man, I have so much fun with my voice changer in the games that I play online. Whoa! I almost jumped right into that. That's right. That's right. Alright. Fire Toad wins the day. Thank goodness. I was like, man, I do not want to have to play through that castle again because a lot of that was just so... who required so much concentration. <laughs> Dave, I hate Apple Watches. Me, tell girlfriend I love you. Apple, which one? <laughs> when the watch exposes you like that, jeez. <laughs> Yikes. What's the next area? I think it's the snowy one, right? Ooh, frosted. Okay. Are we going to an icicle glacier or are we going to the water levels? I'm feeling more inclined to go to Frosted Glacier, just because the water levels doesn't sound very appealing. <laughs> PK memes! It really, it really does sound like he's saying that, to be honest. <laughs> Phil the computer, welcome to the stream. I like your icon, by the way. Man of culture, I see. Hold on, I have to pee. I'll pee back. Thank you for letting us know. <laughs> I appreciate you. Dun, 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 dun. We're gonna go to the Frosted Glacier. I've decided. I've decided. Boom Boom is back again? I thought I dealt with you earlier. You monster. 
I love the way the these levels look in the in the New Super Mario Brothers art style. Just like the way that the blues look with the accenting colors in the background, I think is just really satisfying to look at. It makes me want to boom boom in my- <laughs> What am I supposed to make of that? <laughs> what does that even mean? Oh my goodness, this makes these levels so easy! Look at this, yeet! And just like that. Just like that. Now that coin was supposed to be so much harder to get, I feel like. Oh, you can't wall jump with this outfit or something? I feel like I was supposed to go underneath and get that there. Well, whatever that was going to be up there is going to be lost to time. And it wasn't a star coin. I just noticed that this toad model blinks. I can see him blinking. Interesting. <laughs> I've never noticed that before. Whoa! Ah! I'm gonna miss that one. Yep. Oh well. Oh well! That was, like, right onto the beat with the music. Is this the main theme just reused and add, like, and it just adds a couple instruments or something? This sounds exactly like Acorn Plains. Ooh! I'm rich! Ah! Right on top of the flagpole. Whew. All right. Man, this is like... I think so far, this, like, icicle slash glacier level has been my favorite. Also, let's pick up this blue Yoshi. This blue baby Yoshi. Don't they do different things depending on the color? All right. I, I normally don't ask this many questions when I'm playing through something, but I legitimately don't remember a whole lot about the uh, new Super Mario Brothers games. Other than they're just fun. Look at him, he's singing! He's singing! Oh my god, can I stay in place for a second, please? Don't! Okay. All, all that work for one coin. Yeah, that was so worth it. Yes, eat my enemies. Oh, bye. He came right out of that pipe and into Yoshi's mouth. Oh my goodness! Holy cow, I skidded for so long there. Oh, crap. How that hit me, I have no idea when I have Yoshi in front of me. Whoop! Oh my god, look at this! <laughs> I'm skidding for so far! Oh, you can put your enemies in bubbles. That's what he does. Hello there, welcome to the stream, Dark Angel. Welcome, welcome. Frosty Fest was cool, better than last year's. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Frosty Fest was really good this year. I really liked it. I liked how they also added, um, like, sparkling effects to all of the ink colors uh, for the occasion. I thought that was awesome. Alright, I don't think I can wall jump with this Yoshi. Yeah, alright. One second! 
There we go. Moving right along. Ah! He just killed me! I couldn't wall jump to save myself! What in the world? Zelda better than... What? Oh my gosh, what are you guys even saying? <laughs> oh. Nabbit is back, but is it worth finding him? That's a good question. Sorry that it came late, I had to eat and then played Metopia, if that is how you spell it. Um, I think it's with an I instead of an E, but welcome to the stream, Dark Angel. Hope you're having a good Monday evening. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us. And why is everyone eating instead of me? Okay. Maybe it's better I don't have Yoshi for this level, because I just skate all over the place. Uh -huh. Whoa! Okay, note to self, don't freeze them, because they'll just push you. Oh my god, no, I tilted the wrong way! <gasps> Poopy! That was my name spelled D-A-N-T. At least as far as I can tell. All right, give me an acorn. Ugh. <laughs> Use Nabbit to catch Nabbit? That would be almost insulting to him, wouldn't it? <laughs> Please leave my re read my last chat. No! No, Pika, because it's insulting. I won't tolerate that kind of language towards my life. Excuse me. Whoa! 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 <laughs> that was really scary for a second. Not again! Whoa! Alright, I was prepared for it that time. <gasps> okay. Now we just gotta not fall. Not falling. Woo! It's really satisfying getting those three star coins in the level. <laughs> oh, I forgot to put the E in my name. Oh, I've been calling you Dante this whole time. I thought you were... Okay. So is your real name Dante? Is that what I'm getting? Is that what I'm understanding? Don't lose this one. I tried my best and we, we came through. Thank you for the good luck, Dave. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, more power-ups, please. I need them. I am inhuman. Did you see those reaction times in that last part of the level? Insanity. Absolute inhuman reactions. Another castle! I feel like I've been playing nothing but castles. Or maybe I'm just misremembering, but... I feel like a majority of this playthrough has just been <laughs> me, in a, me in a castle. Oh my goodness! That was... Nyeh! Nyeh! Ow. Alright, well, I went too far with that one. Whoa! That was right in front of my face. The weird thing about these... Like, the ice power-up is that... The icicles, or I guess like the, the f ice orbs that you throw out, um, don't have the same weight or behaviors as the fireballs, which I think is weird. Oh my... Yeah. We're booking it! We're booking it to a checkpoint! Ah! Is there something up here? No. Okay. All right. Oh my gosh! Thank goodness. 
All right. Oh, look at the little Bowser Jr. icons on the Bowser Jr. is his name, by the way. Bowser Jr. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying my hardest not to throw. I forgot about this one. This one actually I remember a little bit. Just because of the constantly rising platform. Oh, okay. That was specifically put there just for someone like me to wall jump into that. I'm at a loss. Alright. We're good. Never mind. All is well in the world, I think. Don't they usually keep, like, a hidden block somewhere? Of, like, a power-up of some sort? Right in front of the boss door? Maybe not. Alright. Well, I guess we'll have to- Aha! I knew it! Perfect! Oh, all right. Ah, oh, if I clear this in the first try, I'm gonna be so happy. We haven't had to continue once this entire castle playthrough. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Look at Toad just staring at his enemies, inflicting fear into their hearts and souls. Ha <laughs> ha oh. He looks so weird when he's that small. <laughs> Something about him just looks wrong. Alright, I, I kind of want to switch characters now. Can I switch to Toadette? Toadette? Also, what's going on over here? Is there like a force field or something around the <laughs> around Peach's castle? What the heck is that? Hmm. All right. Interesting. Uh, so where's the menu? Change character. I'm gonna try Toadette now. <laughs> See what that's like. This is so cursed. I never thought I'd see the day where I'd want to willingly play as Toadette. Oof! Well, okay, so something about this character makes it, like, easier? How does that work? Is that all tied to the, um, Super Crown ability? I'd assume so. Pika says, by the way, I won't be talking in the chat no more. Sounds good, Pika. Sounds good. Woof. Oh, those are, those are Goombas? The heck? Are they just in like a shell of some sort? Why have I never seen this? Sebi, welcome to the stream! Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good... Oh my gosh, Monday evening. Thanks for stopping by. I'm just realizing that I don't think I can get up there, because I don't have the fire flower anymore. Well, this sucks! This sucks! Aha! Now I can. Okay! Okay! Don't! Stop! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Gibran says my GPS, GSP on Luigi is under 100,000. I am so bad. It, it, there's no worries, Gibran. If you want to, um, we can play in an arena later. 
and uh, we can uh, get some practice rounds in, if you'd like. Perfect. Perfect! Oh, well, there he goes. Oh my gosh, I, the, the Lord giveth and the Lord taketh away. Oh, thank goodness. All right, I'm outie. This level is over! I have two of the three star coins. That's a good enough for me. If I don't get anything more than two, it feels like I didn't even play the level. <laughs> Maybe that's just the completionist in me talking. Oh my gosh, come on! Come on! Okay, not worth it. I'm just gonna go to the flag, I almost died. Uh. This is my alt account. I couldn't see my message on my main. Why? I wonder why that is. What's your, uh, what's your main account, Sebi? Gotta go. Hope we can play together soon. Sounds good, Overkill. Have a good rest of your night. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. I appreciate ya. Also, welcome to the Discord. Oof. Do we have to fight this thing or something? I accidentally ran into it. Oh my god, there's like five of them! Oh my god, they lose their sunglasses <laughs> when you stomp on them. They look so weird without them! What the heck is that?! <sighs> All that work for a star. <laughs> what the heck? <gasps> and I think I can just stay here and the acorn will come to me? Yes! Yes! Great job, phone. You're at 10%. Good job, Pika's phone. It's running out of battery all the time. <laughs> oh no, it's my arch nemesis. He's flying squirrel things. I swear to God, if one just flies out of nowhere again and hits me, I'm gonna scream. Okay. Okay. No more funny business, except for that, because that was entirely my fault. <gasps> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Can I not go this way? I guess not. Oh my gosh. That was like... That was almost comedic timing. How quickly. That just happened. <laughs> that actually just happened. What in the world? Ah, oh, scaling the mountainside. Alright. That's one. Out of my way, nerds! I am so bad. I am so bad. Either I'm so bad, or this level is just really hard for some reason. <laughs> I'm, t I'm more leaning towards the latter. Like, I feel like these enemies are just timed so weird! Okay. Okay. This is the round. This is the run! Run of destiny. And I just got hit again! That's it. Just powering through the level. Can't even deal with these enemies right now. I don't even know how to get up there. Don't care! I'm out of here. I oh my god! Jesus! <laughs> I gotta go to bed, so have a great night. Have a good night, Pika. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. Say hi to Evie for us as well. Oh, man. What is this level? I have one life left. What in the world? These flying squirrels are gonna be the end of me! Okay. I'm big. We're good. We're in this. Now this is the run. 
Now I'm convinced that this is the run. <laughs> Are you kidding me? What? Why? Why is this level like this? God. <laughs> Has this always been this hard? I'm, uh, supposedly, Super Luigi U is hard. How'd you burn through all those lives? So, each individual character has their own set of lives, and they all start with uh, five. So, Blue Toad has like 39 or something. And, um, wait, what? What is this? Hold on. Why am I back here? Uh, Blue Toad has like five. Blue Toad has like 36 or something. And Toadette starts out with five. Oh my god, I have to beat this one again. <laughs> what up, Checkers? Welcome back to the stream, Checkers. How's it going? Hope you're having a good night. Good Monday evening. Thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out with us. How's it going? You, uh, you, you annoy Terra at all today? I hope you did. Lies. Lies and slander that I just got hit by one of those Goombas. Uh... Oh, isn't there, like, blocks over here? I just did this level, like, a couple minutes ago. Oh, I not remember this. But yeah, Checkers, we're just hanging out and playing some uh, new Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. Trying out the game, seeing what, seeing what it's all about. And so far, it's, it's actually pretty nice. Just like, you know, classic Mario gameplay. Classic 2D Mario. What more can you ask for? <gasps> it's a super crown! Okay, so what does this do? Oh, okay, so this is like... What? This is like the acorn ability, but always? And like, better in some way? I just lost it that way. <laughs> Dave, welcome back to the stream. Um, it was worth it though, I guess, because we got the super, like the star coin out of it. But I don't get like what's what's so good about the super crown? I wonder. Oh, we got all the coins too! Woohoo! We only got two last time, if I remember correctly. Oh my God! Why is this game so punishing? Ugh! Remember when I said this game was all about rage? Well, this is what I mean. I see! I see that now! Jesus! <laughs> Good lord, this game can't give me a break! I want the Super Crown back. I want to know more about Peachette and what's up with that- what's up with that character. Admittedly, I haven't done a whole lot of research on it, but supposedly it makes the game easier? I guess? So is this- like, Peach? Or is this a form of Toadette? Who is this character? What what conclusions am I supposed to come to with this character? Alright, that was a much better time. <laughs> I had a much better time doing it that way. It's kind of cute, I guess. Okay, okay, I see. I see. Can't get no peace in this game. I can't just have a good time playing through these levels. Has to throw so many hazards at me. What the? Whoop, 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 whoop! I'm done. I'm done. Bye. Oh, and I got to the top of the pole that time. Yeet! It's Toadette transformed. So, the character I'm looking at takes the appearance of Peach, but is actually Toadette instead? Huh? Do you plan on doing challenges on this game? Um, I'm thinking about it. Apparently they're really good. So, um, it seems like it would be worth actually playing through them. But, um... This week, I think, I think the rest of this week we're gonna be playing, uh, like, Smash Brothers. And stuff like that. I don't know what we're doing on Friday, but at least for this coming Thursday... Oh, we're doing viewer battles in Smash. Whoop! Are you kidding me?! I'm probably gonna die this run, but it's okay, because I have six lives this time. 
instead of like four. <laughs> Her laughter is just so maniacal in a way. Because you can be Peachette and save Peach? Oh my gosh, that's awesome. That probably looks really weird, but still, I like that nonetheless. <gasps> it's like a magical girl transformation. They change... Ooh! They change form, but they're still the same people. I suppose so. It makes a little bit more sense. It's like a super form of Toadette, I guess. Please let me have this mushroom. Oh! If there's one thing I want in life, it's to not die on this level! Okay, is this one supposed to be hard? Or am I just not going slow enough? I need to go at my own pace, I guess. Ooh, that was a close one. Alright. This is the one. Yeah. No, dude! What? I was right in front of it! What? Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Give me a star man and give me an acorn. <laughs> I need both to get past like the first part of this level. Jesus Christ, this level's cursed. Frosted Glacier 4. It's the worst. Get out of my way. All of you. There we go. Easy money. it just like that. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit of a, a maneuver. Getting up there. If, see, if I hadn't... This jump button thing is weird. Like this little twirly thing being bound to the jump button instead, I'm just gonna abandon it. I don't want to die again. I know there's a super coin over there, but do not want to die. Good night. There's so much danger in this level. All right, you know what? That's good enough. I'm good. All right, we got through it. That's all that matters. Level has no right to be that difficult. Jeez. Uh, Dave says, where do you work at besides YouTube? Um, I do have a job outside of content creation, um, but I don't know if I can actually say where because I don't think that they're comfortable with me doing that. Oh, and the ghost houses. Don't even get me started on the ghost houses. These are just as maniacal. These are just as evil. Yep, there it is. All right. <laughs> oh, there's like four! Oh, perfect. Where does this go? Ah. <sighs> okay. Now... Thank goodness we have another life. I'm not big enough to crash through those blocks. <laughs> uh. Okay. Now we just gotta wait. Part of the Illuminati, what? Where's your proof, Aiden? I just bamboozled myself. Oh, yeah. <sighs> We're so close. 
Like, it's this and then the final castle for this area. With Wendy. <laughs> of all freak- Of all Koopa kids to fight against. Wendy. Owns this part of the map. Why that is, I can't tell you. How am I supposed to get that coin? I genuinely don't know what I'm supposed to do about it. What the heck was that? Oh, okay. This boo being right next to this jumping point is really annoying me. All right, we got this, got this. It's right down. Stop it! Oh, Jesus. Okay, we got the first one. <laughs> I'm so bad at this, I know. It's okay, we'll make it through, I believe. Super crown! Thank goodness I get two free hits. Peach Head is kind of cute. I don't know. As cursed as it is, I think she's actually kind of adorable. Oh my gosh, I can finally do this. That feels really good. Another life. Perfect. We have seven now! Yay! Boo, Felipe, welcome to the stream! Welcome to the stream. You are now Alakette. Can you imagine? <laughs> can you imagine that? That's even more cursed, I feel like. Which one was that? The bottom one? I think that was the bottom one. <laughs> but welcome to the stream, Felipe. I hope you're having a good one. I don't know, just something about... Something about Toadette turning into Peach and being called Peachette is like... Very, very... It feels like it's going against nature. <laughs> in a way. It feels like God didn't intend for <laughs> Toadette to turn into Peach like this. But she's cute, I'll give her that. You are definitely correct in that regard. We finally exterminated the B-Man, so I'm the new B-Man. My first order as the new B-Man is to make B-Man F-Man. Ooh, for F Felipe Man. <laughs> I like it. But what about B-Man Jr.? Is B-Man Jr. still a thing? <laughs> Did you exterminate him too? <laughs> All right. Now where to go? That is the question. Oh, was this door? Well. God, this house is just throwing me for a loop. There's hidden entrances and exits everywhere. We should be close to the end, though, because I have two out of three star coins. One of my streaming friends is, like, really obsessed with Toadette, so I'm sure he's loving this game right now. I was kind of hoping that was going to be a, like a mushroom or a power-up of some sort. What's in here? Is this back where I was? No, it's not. Perfect. Anyway, I've been doing fine, just the typical procrastinating, but this time on an art project. What's the, what's the project about? Art was like one of my favorite subjects to do uh, like homework for, just because it was all so creative. What is this? Pointing this direction? Ah! You see what I mean? What the heck is that? Where is Rosalina Chan? You know, that's a good question. I would forward that to Nintendo, because I don't think she's actually in this game. Like, in any form. Oh, I barely made that jump. Holy guacamole! Oh! All right, and then that's the that's the ghost house. Okay, perfect. Now that that's finally over. Woo! We did it! We beat these cursed levels! Oh man! 
Felipe says, since so I'm in a vocational school, I take design. We had to draw multiple angle still life, and now we're inking it in Adobe Illustrator plus Photoshop. Those are actually really valuable programs to learn, because as I understand it, they're, um, they're industry standards as far as professional use. Um, not that I'm in the field or anything, but I have a couple of friends that are, and they are very, very reliant on things like Lightroom and Illustrator and just the whole Adobe suite. So I think that's cool that you're actually getting to learn that. The only one that I have, like, remote experience in is, um, Adobe Premiere. But all the knowledge that I have has been self-taught, so... <laughs> I don't know a whole lot in that regard, but... Uh, Premiere is pretty much the only Adobe program that I know how to use. But so far, it's been really, really good. I've been satisfied with it. For the most part, I say. I want to make that very abundantly clear, because sometimes it works, or sometimes it doesn't work, and when it doesn't work, it's almost like... It chooses not to work in the most inconvenient of times. See those, those moves that I was just pulling off? Crazy. Oh! This game saved me! Maybe it's not so evil to me after all. How in the world are you supposed to get up there? I don't even know. Claire, welcome to the stream! How is your Monday night going? Welcome, welcome. Hope it's going well. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us. We're playing some new Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe for the Nintendo Switch. And we're uh, giving it a try and seeing how we like it. So far, it's been really, really fun. I kind of want to play this game in, like, multiplayer in some way, but... I don't, uh... I don't know if I have anyone that would be immediately available to come over and play soon. Can I share some interesting LEGO video game stories? Sure! Feel free, Claire. You always have the most interesting things to say. <laughs> Alright. Whew! This is going surprisingly well. Surprisingly well. I'm not sure if I should be suspicious or not. Oh god, it's a Wendy ship! You'd have to pay me to ride something like that. <laughs> Felipe says, yep, and since I'm a student, I get like 60% off all of the Adobe products for a year. That is wonderful. Because those can get really expensive if you, play, if you pay for the Creative Cloud. And I think, actually, now that I think about it, I think Adobe Creative Cloud is basically the only way that you can use the Adobe Suite. I don't think there's a way for, it just, for you just to pay for them outright anymore. I think it's all that yearly, that yearly cost. Fly me over and I will gladly play New Super Mario Brothers U Deluxe with you. That would be amazing, wouldn't it? <laughs> this game is surprisingly fun. And I was kind of saying it at the beginning of the stream, uh, back when that bald gamer was asking me, but um, this game gets a lot of flack for a couple of different reasons. But I think that this game does a really good job at being a good 2D Mario game. I don't think it's trying to be anything else. I don't think it's trying to reinvent the wheel in any sort of way or, like, be any sort of level of groundbreaking. I think it's just the goal is just to be a good 2D Mario game, and I think it accomplished that, accomplishes that with flying colors. I think it's really good at that. There's a lot, but I'm going to tell you the times me, my cousin Haley, and my dad played LEGO Indiana Jones. Oh my goodness. I played so much of that game back at my first job. My first job, for those of you who uh, aren't aware was a camp counselor at my local YMCA. And I was basically just watching kids <laughs> for like hours on end while their parents would go work out or like go to their own jobs or something. And they would have me play a lot of Lego games and a lot of Minecraft. Oh boy. I think I should end. We should probably end sometime soon. What is this? What is this? Oh jeez. Is this a boss fight that I didn't sign up for? This is a boss fight, isn't it? Yep. All right. All right. We'll do this and then we'll call it. I guess. Soda jungle ship. <laughs> and you were shorter than most of the... Surprisingly, yes. Or I guess unsurprisingly if you're Mika because she always expects me to be the shortest. <laughs> but some of them were actually taller than me despite the fact that they were like 10 years younger than me. It made me sad. It almost felt like I had no power over them, even though I did. <laughs> I'd be like, hey, stop being so rowdy over there! And then they'd look down at me and be like, okay. And I'm like, whew, I'm glad they're being compliant. 
<laughs> or else this would be really awkward. <laughs> Where's the last one? Whoop! Super crown! This is a really cool ability. After playing with it for a little bit, I think this is actually one of my favorite power-ups so far. Just for the simple fact that it turns Toadette into Peach, I think that's a unique idea that hasn't really been explored too much in the Mario series. None of the characters actually turn into someone else, which I think is cool. So years ago, my mom got me and Haley the LEGO Indiana Jones game. Me and Haley played it, but we were having a hard time with it. And, oh my gosh, we're underwater now? And my dad was watching us, wondering why we were having such a hard time. I know my dad would do something similar for me whenever I would play, like, really, um, hard Super Mario levels. The Super Mario 64. Pokemon Snap is another one he'd have to read out to me. Woomy, welcome to the stream, Agent 10! I saw you were getting on, uh, Smash Brothers Ultimate earlier. Welcome, welcome. I hope you're having a good Monday night. Thanks for hanging out with us. We're playing some Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe. For the Switch. Trying it out. Getting a feel for it, seeing how we like it. And so far, it's actually been pretty fun. Right now, we're playing as Peachette with the infamous Super Crown <laughs> power up. Oh my gosh, this thing is chasing me forever. There we go. Peachy Mushroom Power! What up? It's so cute. All right, who are you? Are you Bowser Jr.? Are you Baby Bowser? Make up your mind! I actually don't know what to do here. Ah! Okay, never mind. I think I know. Yeah, that's right! Also, Alec, how come on days I wake up earlier on Smash at 6 a.m.? <laughs> um... Because I don't sleep. That's why. <laughs> I have a hard time sleeping at night, so most of the time I'm just playing Smash or something. <laughs> to answer your question. <laughs> but to be honest, I could be shamed for that too. Yeah, like, I've always been this way, and I can't tell you why. Um, my mom will be the first one to tell you that she's never been able to get me to go to bed at a decent time, so she just kind of gave up at some point <laughs> during my childhood. And I've been like this ever since. I'm usually awake until like 7am these days. And then I go to bed around then. But today I'll probably be taking a nap just because I've been so tired today for some reason. It's because of that darn phone! You're always on that darn phone! My mom would say the same thing and I would have to try and rationalize with her and be like, Mom, that is absolutely not what it is! <laughs> I can lie in bed and stare into darkness for like three hours and still not be able to go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> His dad just like, don't worry, Junior, I'll save you. Uh, Claire says, then my dad realized the levels were based on the scenes from the movies and never saw the movies, so he got us the movies, and we watched all three movies, and then we were done watching. That's awesome! My mom has been trying to get me to watch the Indiana Jones movies for a long time, and I just haven't gotten around to it. But to be fair, I've suggested movies to her in the past before, and she still hasn't watched them. Like, years later. Ooh, this is like a jungle level. All right. We'll go ahead and save right there. Mika says, I actually looked up the Baby Bowser design. He actually did look like Junior, but a little smaller. Well, you know, he he does still look different, though. As, as small of a difference as it may be. I think his later designs are where that difference actually um, gets a little bit bigger or a little bit more um, defined. But um, let's go back to the menu, so... Uh, oh, there's a quick save button. I didn't know that. All right. So we're gonna go ahead back to the main menu. Um, Claire says we actually looked at the levels with Dad, and when we did the last Crusade levels, he was a pro at them. Nice. Uh, Felipe says the reason why you can't sleep is because you're looking at that darn phone. It's those darn video games. They're rotting your brain. She would say stuff like that all the time, but I think I've, uh, I think I've turned her mind around on her opinion of video games at this point. Um, what if Lucina was real? I would, um, I would already be married and have five kids. Uh, but the new Yoshi straight up uses the junior- Exactly! That's so weird! I could go on a whole tangent about that, but anyways. 
uh, we're gonna go ahead and call it a stream for the day. Um, thank you all so much for hanging out with me and tuning in. Um, I think maybe next time we stream this game, we'll play some Super Luigi U, just to kind of shake it up a bit. Or maybe the challenges? Some of the challenges? I don't know. I don't know. I guess that'll be something for future Alec, or future us to decide. I'll put up a, like, a Twitter poll or something. Anyways, um, so that was New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe for the Switch. Pleasantly surprised at how much fun I was having, to be honest. Um, really, really fun game. As I was saying earlier, very classic 2D Mario. Um, no one really does it better than Nintendo, I think, as far as the 2D platformers go. And New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe is, like, the epitome of that, I think. Um, super fun. It's on the Switch now, so it's really easy to be able to just take your Switch with you and have instant two-player co-op uh, pretty much anywhere you go because you have the two Joy-Cons always with you, which I think is cool. Um, yeah, but I'm pleasantly surprised. Um, as far as new content goes, um, I can't remember who said it earlier, but um, aside from Toadette and the Peachette ability, and I think um, there was something else too, I can't remember what it is, but... Aside from basically Toadette and Peachette, the whole entire experience is going to be pretty similar to the Wii U version. So I will say, if you've played the Wii U version, maybe... I, I would maybe suggest skipping on this title just because it is a full-price game. However, if the idea of instant two-player co-op entices you, or if you're just a fan of 2D Mario in general, I think this is still a very, very good buy because it includes Super Mario Bros. U., and Super Luigi U, so pretty much all the DLC content that you would have gotten in uh, New Super Mario Bros. U, back on the Wii U, god, that's so confusing, um, is here. And the fact, add on to the fact that it's portable and you can take it anywhere you go, uh, is also a really nice uh, selling point as well. So, uh, pleasantly surprised with New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe, but um, that is going to be it for today's stream. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me and tuning in live. I appreciate every single one of you. Um, and I think that's pretty much it. Oh, one more thing, um, uh, before we leave, um, this coming Thursday, we are going to be playing some Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. We're going to be doing some viewer battles, getting some fights in, so if anybody wants to fight me in that game, feel free to tune in on Thursday. Um, and let me go ahead and catch up on chat here before we take off, so, um, I'm not kidding, when we got to the Holy Grail, he knew the cutscenes and were... And where Donovan drank the cup, he repeated the line he chose poorly. <laughs> wow. So your dad's like a big fan of Indiana Jones, I guess. Felipe says my mom still thinks that and freaks out if I walk out looking at my phone in Costco. Wow. <laughs> Thankfully, my mom doesn't do that anymore. And if I'm going to be honest, I think she actually uses her phone more in public than I do. <laughs> I don't know. I don't really have a much of a reason to, uh, to look at my phone or, like, check my texts or anything like that while I'm out and about and, like, running errands. So, um... If you're watching, Mom, that's the truth, all right? <laughs> Anyways, uh, Ninja Kid says, Why am I so surprised I would have... S I would... Wait, why am I so surprised you would have 600 kids with Lucina and be married with a house and a car in a heartbeat? I don't think cars actually exist in the Fire Emblem universe. <laughs> Maybe we'd have, like, a Pegasus? A Pegasus as far as, like, getting to and from? Anyways, uh... <laughs> I would marry Toru in a flash of light. I mean, there are so many good choices... To be honest, I like your shirt, Alec. Thank you so much. This is the one that I actually wore for the first day of, um, for the first day of Smash Week back in December. But it's basically uh, a bunch of Smash characters playing Smash in front of a TV. I think they're probably playing Melee just because they have a GameCube right there. You've got, like, Robin, Peach, Female Villager, Palutena, Lucina, my woman, uh, Wii Fit Trainer, uh, Zero Suit, Rosalina, uh, Luma, for some reason, and Zelda. So, I really like it. It's a nice shirt. Anyway, um, enough about my clothing. <laughs> so, as I said earlier, thank you all so much for hanging out with me and playing this game. It was a pleasant surprise. Is that Rosalina Chan? Yes. I hope you all have a good rest of your Monday evening. I will see you all in the Discord, because I'll probably be chilling in there for the, for the remainder of the night, because I'm going to go get some food here in a little bit. Um, and I'm probably going to be looking for people to play Smash Brothers with. So if anybody's looking for some matches, feel free to head into the Discord. If you're not a part of the Discord already, Nightbot's going to drop a link in the chat. So, um, anyways, with all of that said, and without further ado, I think that's, I think there's only one thing left to say. There's only one thing left to say, and that is, of course, of course, as always, 
I'm Alec and stuff, and I will see you all again real soon. Bye! <laughs> Have a good rest of your night, guys. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. I know I've said that like a million times, but I genuinely do appreciate hanging out with you guys and getting to play games together. It's, it's like one of my favorite highlights of my week. So have a good rest of your night, guys. Thank you all so much for tuning in for this bonus stream on a Monday evening. And I'll have a, have a good rest of your night, guys. Oh, what's this? Um, oh, yeah. Happy birthday, Aiden. Hope you have a good rest of your night as well. Thank you so much. Dylan, hope you, hope you have a good night. <laughs> Should have been a Mario Maker remake. I would love to see a Mario Ma Maker remake made for the Switch. Man, that was a hard sentence to say. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling now. I'm going to click the mute button. You all have a good rest of your night, and I'll see you all in the Discord.